Hi guys, Alice Taylor down here at Living Golf Academy and today we're going to test should we be hitting driver or three wood off the tee. Right then guys, so if you're new down to my channel, welcome down to Ali Taylor Golf. If you are a returning viewer, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed today's video and you don't subscribe, click the button and ring the notification bell. That way you'll make sure that you hear as soon as I drop new videos. But for today, we're gonna to talk about whether we should be hitting driver or three wood from the tee. Certainly something that a lot of guys, when they come for coaching with me, talk about that they maybe feel that they're not that accurate with driver and yet get three wood in play more often. So I'm gonna hit 10 shots measured on Trackman with my Titleist TS3 driver and my Ping G410 three wood. Like I said, 10 balls with each. We're gonna see how many fairways I hit and we're gonna see what the difference in distance is. And from those shots, we're gonna decide, should you be hitting driver more often? Certainly for me, should I be hitting driver more often? Or should I be dropping down to three wood? And what are the pros and cons of doing driver or three wood from the tee? <coughs> right then guys, so it's that eternal dilemma, isn't it? That a lot of guys feel that they want to hit driver because that's the club that's gonna get them the furthest down the hole but they feel they lack maybe accuracy with driver and by dropping down to three wood, they feel they can get in play. And I understand that because from the short stuff, they can hit whatever club they want. There's no point in hitting driver if it's in grass that long, it's just lost balls and it's not enjoyable for your golf. But 10 shots with driver first off for me. Like I said, we're gonna use Titus Pro V1X as ever, Trackman, but 10 shots and let's see how many fairways I can hit. Okay, so solid. Don't necessarily feel I was maybe going at those quite as quick as when I'm really going for a big one, but try to get it in play. All look really, really good. We're gonna switch over onto three wood. And being honest, I think this is the first three wood I've ever had in my bag where I've actually felt like I would want to hit this off the tee. I really like hitting it. I love the way it looks, feels and it performs really, really well. So, switch over, three wood, 10 shots again, then we're gonna look at how accurate and distance I was with driver, same with three wood. Right then, I think that's gonna be pretty tough to pick. So not all great strikes, so not all out the middle of the club, but let's look at the 10 shots from driver, 10 shots from three wood, let's look at the distance, and then I'll decide, personally for me, should I be hitting driver or three wood more often from the tee? Right then guys, so we can see there, all 10 drives would be in the fairway, couple down the right, couple down the left, Average carry just over 270 and rolling out just under 300. So nice and accurate and very, very playable. So we see with three wood, again, I'm hitting every single fairway. 242 carry, 263 total. So again, nice and accurate and definitely playable off every single tee shot. Right then, guys, so we can see with my results there, you know, I hit all 10 fairways with driver and with three wood, but then there was about a 30 yard gap between driver and three wood. 
So for me, I'm not willing to give up that 30 yards. You know, I'd much rather be hitting nine iron than six iron into the green. I think for me personally, my thought process is, I don't necessarily think I'm any more accurate with driver. I think if I make a bad swing, I will miss the fairway with driver the same as I would with three wood. The only saving grace is that three wood doesn't continue on that offline direction as far. So potentially it could hang on to the edge of the fairway. But I tend to back myself that if I make a good swing, if driver's the right club, I'll hit driver. I think for guys who struggle with confidence, getting that three wood out, getting a few in play, but it's noticing what you're doing differently between driver and three wood or five wood, whatever you tee off with, that's gonna help you get that driver in play more often. Like I said, for me, the only time I'm really dropping down is maybe if it's a dog leg where driver would run through the fairway or possibly try to stay short of some trouble. But I'll always, if driver is usable, I'll always hit driver, try and get as far down the hole as possible and leave myself the shortest possible shot in. So guys, hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have, like and share it. Comment below, I'll get back to as many people as I can. If you have enjoyed it, click the subscribe button, ring the notification bell. Make sure you get my content as soon as it drops. Follow me on all the social media platforms, all under Ali Taylor Golf. Hopefully catch up with some of you guys down here soon. Stay in contact.